You can make a lot of money from hidden caches, obtaining rare items and those you need for the Kappa container. In a previous video, I went over all the 40 hidden caches on Shoreline, and you can find that here. But in this video, I'm going to walk you through all the 23 hidden caches on Customs. Unlike Shoreline, Customs is quite dense, and therefore I'm going to do this in one take. Starting off in no particular order, we're going to begin at the RUAF roadblock. We're going to make our way down this hill, just under these pipes, and the first one's by this bush. The second one's pretty close, we're just going to go to the other pipes, just here. And you'll find the stash in this bush. The next one's located at Elbow at Warehouse 17. And just outside the repair garage in these tires is number three. For number four, we're going to head to the end of the tracks by New Construct. And this one's just by this big tree here on the right. For the next one, we're just going to head over the tracks. And it's located here in this bush. Following the back wall, we're going to head over to Old Gas. And just inside the compound, if we come back on ourselves, we'll find number six in the corner. For number seven, we're going to head towards the factory shacks. Go underneath this platform. And this stash is just a little further down on the left. For the next one, we're going to move closer to the dorms area. After making your way through Skeleton, we're going to cross the road. And this one is just inside the blue container. Now we're going to follow the back wall of the bus terminal. Once we reach the end, using the corner as a reference, we're going to go a little inland at a 45 degree angle. And the cache is just here. Heading back, we're going to make our way to the front of the bus terminal. And the next one's just inside this tire. Heading down the road, we're going to make our way to the back of the gas station. Jump over the barbed wire, and just by this bush, which is in line with the blue car, is number 11. Heading north, we're going to locate number 12. Jumping through this gap, we're going to follow the wall. And the cache is here, right in this corner. The next one takes us back in the direction of the bus terminal, go south on the tracks, and just on the right here by the wall is number 13. From here we're going to head north of the tracks, we're going to cut inland and go up the hill. And this next one's to the left of the pylon by this fence. Next, we're going to head east along the edge of the map to Passage Between Rocks. To the left of this rock, you'll see a bush, and the cache is on the other side of this bush. From here, we're going to head south to the compound on top of the hill. And it's located here in this bush. This one can be a little tricky to learn and find, so we're going to go down the path and locate these two rocks. 
turn left and go past these first set of trees. And here on the right amongst these trees is the cache. Now we're going to make our way to military base CP. Locate this bin area. And on the other side of the road, just behind this bin, is the cache. The next one takes us to Scav Checkpoint, just behind the military checkpoint. On the other side of the road, left of this tree, you'll find the cache in this bush. Moving along the wall, we're going to head to Administration Gate. We're going to turn left. And in this far left corner, you'll find cache number 20. Once again, moving along the wall, we're going to locate factory far corner. And you'll find this cache on the other side of these bushes. From here, we're going to go past ZB10 and to the four silos in the middle. And this next cache is just under these pipes to the left. For this last one, we're going to go to the train tracks and head west. Going past the train cart, we're going to jump over the fence. From here, we're going to head north into the warehouse area. And just inside this ditch is cache number 23. The map I used in this video is called Map Genie. I'll leave a link for that in the video description. If you want to see a full run, I have a VOD from my live stream where I hit all 23 caches on customs. I'll also leave a link for that in the video description as well. I hope this video has been helpful and if it has, leave a like, subscribe to the channel for more content like this and drop me a comment letting me know what you've looted from the caches. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, requests, or just want to watch me live, I stream on Twitch most weekdays. All details are found below.